What's happening, film friends? Dave the Film Junkie here. Well, all right. Joe Magniello talking about uh, what's going on with Deathstroke. <laughs> yeah. Um, turns out he's big time involved with this. He's not just starring in it. You know, they didn't just go like, hey, come on. You, you're big and you're, you know, you could fit it. No, this guy is, he's campaigning for this goddamn character. Um, according to him, as he was talking right here, I mean, obviously we knew that you know, we saw the test footage, but that was for Justice League, obviously, with the, the post-credit ending. Um, but then, of course, you know, we were thinking, okay, for Ben Affleck's Batman movie, Deathstroke was going to be the, the main villain, and uh, that was going to be so until who knows what the fuck happened. Matt Reeves came, and now he's starting from scratch. Magnello actually talks about that. He says when he first met with Affleck, it was for the Batman movie. And, uh, you know, as soon as that all played about, uh, pretty much... You know, with the Matt Reeves thing, he was like, what the heck's going on? So, you know, luckily, Magniello is like, okay, but then all of a sudden things started kicking into gear with Gareth Edwards and, uh, you know, Deathstroke. So basically, what Magniello had to do was pretty much pitch the character. Like, he probably just big time researched the character, kind of did like a, a backstory and just had to like, hey, hey, like, here you go. Can, can we do this? This is what he had to say right here. He said, I think it's really interesting to tell that kind of story and tell the truth emotionally of a story like, like that when you're talking about a man who's lost an eye, was betrayed, lost a son, these different types of aspects. And then he says, what I love doing is in an instance like this or like that, I'm able to, at the ground level, I'm able to go back and pitch all my work. So I'm pitching them. This is where I think he comes from. This is where I think he's going. This is the military background. These are some articles that I pulled for you. I also interviewed these people over here. So, man, he's campaigning. He campaigned for Deathstroke. So, hopefully that moves forward with, with Edwards and everything. So, I don't know. I mean, we haven't heard anything, like, confirmed 100%. But, I mean, according to Magniello here, it's sounding. It's sounding like everything's okay, and they liked what, what he pitched. And hopefully Edwards is going to be, like, okay with it, too. And, you know, we get something. Because I, I would like to see it. And I still wish that he would be in the Batman and Reeves' as Batman. And you never know. He might. He could still be. Uh, I wouldn't totally rule that out just yet. But, I mean, who knows where Reeves wants to go with it, depending on, you know, certain things. So, there you go, guys. That's pretty awesome stuff. I like the fact that he's doing that. That You have an actor that is just campaigning for the character. He really wants to play him. You know, because we were worried. We were worried there for a bit. We were thinking, oh, he's cut out of the movie. He's not going to be Deathstroke anymore. And then he posts an image with the Deathstroke creator. And that was like, it reassured us. And sure enough, I mean, that's that's what he was doing. He met with the, the creator. They probably talked all kinds of stuff. And uh, I really respect that. I, re I respect the hell out of that. Because he's not just an actor wanting to play a role that, oh, okay, cool. I'll play that role. No, it's not that. He is... 100% down for it, and I really respect the shit out of that. So there you go, guys. Let me know your thoughts about it down below. What do you think about all that? Hit that like, thumbs up button if you'd be so kind. Subscribe to my channel. Visit filmjunkie.com for all my content that I need to update. And uh, visit the closet for shirts and stickers. Got a new shirt in there. It's a Snyder shirt. All right, guys. Talk to you later.